everyone, you're watching the Yo! Venice Show. I'm Juliet Lamar, and this week, will Pacific Avenue open up two of its lanes currently used for parking? Hmm, we'll find out. And LA County is making history with an all-female board of supervisors, so stay tuned. But first, I'd like to tell you all about our sponsor, DBR Roofing. They handle any and all of your roofing work for residential or commercial property. Our top story today, a school district serving thousands of Westside families is in a legal battle over whether or not to split into two separate districts. We have the details right here and we'll be back with today's news. And now for what's happening in your neighborhood. Since February 2019, if you drive down Pacific Avenue on a weekday between the hours of 8 a.m. and 8 p.m., you'll notice the loss of two traffic lanes, one on either side of the road, being used for parking. This change was put in place for pedestrian safety and to slow traffic, but it has caused more traffic issue congestion. Any move to change the current traffic situation and open up those lanes has been tabled for the time being, and there is no word on when the motion will be voted on again by parking and transportation committees. For the first time ever in 150 years of existence, the Los Angeles Board of Supervisors is completely made up of women. Senator Holly Mitchell sealed the historic board on Wednesday when she won the board's second district race by wide margins. Each woman serving on the board has an impressive political and governmental background. These ladies will have their hands full as the LA County Board of Supervisors is considered one of the most powerful local governmental bodies in the country, overseeing a $35 billion budget and the largest jail system in in the country and one of the largest public health infrastructures in the country. Good luck, ladies. I know you're going to do great. That's all the news we have for you today. Thank you all so much for tuning in. I'm Juliette Lamar, and you take care.